what is up you guys? I am here in Mykonos. I'm back in Mykonos because I actually have a flight from Mykonos to Athens and Athens back to New York where I'm heading home in the next couple days. But before I go, I was offered to stay here at this amazing hotel called Cabo Tagu, which is one of the best hotels here in Mykonos. So I was like, yeah, I would really like to stay there. So let's do it. Look at this place. So as you walk in, this is like the diamond suite and it's literally just me. You're seeing this is a huge, huge just living area and this pool out here is literally just for me. I feel like multiple people are supposed to be staying in this room, but it's literally just me. <laughs> there is a master bedroom over here. This is one of three master bedrooms. It, it, I, that's just insane to me. And then you, let's see, you go out here onto the nice balcony. What? I've never stayed in a place this nice. I was literally just in Santorini, staying in like this little hotel for like 50 bucks a night. And uh, now I'm here in Mykonos and this is amazing. I am so happy. I have this whole massive pool. And then there's a hot tub over there too, which is also for me, I guess. But let's go, let's go check out the rest of this place. So this is the second master bedroom. I think this is the one I'm gonna stay in because it's got the private hot tub right there, which is cool. But it also has this amazing, like, master bath here. It's got a sauna spa right there and this giant mirror that I need to do my hair. <laughs> and then you also have the second floor downstairs. This leads to, like, the bat cave. This place is crazy. And this right here is the third master bedroom on the on the lower level with its own couch and massive massive balcony as well so each room has its own balcony that's pretty crazy and these really nice shutters i think these things electronically close down again it is literally just me here in this massive suite by myself i'm very thankful to Cabo tagu for setting me up with this place it is very nice of you i'm gonna I'm gonna go swimming now. So I decided to take the camera in the pool. It's very deep, I'm on my tippy toes. But I wanted to show you what the edge looked like. Come on. Uh, that over there is Mykonos Town. Right over there. And then this is the rest of Cabo Tagu. Oh man, it's very deep. All right, let's get the day started. All right, you guys, now it is finally time. The main purpose of this video, it is the thumbnail, it's the title, it's what you all came here for. I'm gonna be hiding my very first treasure here in Mykonos, Greece and uh, I want you guys to find it. So this is gonna be in a video collaboration with the Jerkies. So the Jerkies are gonna be releasing a video the same time that this video comes out actually, and they're gonna be like, releasing uh, some details that are gonna help you find this treasure. It's kind of like a cross collaboration thing because those are the guys who actually started doing this idea. Like they're the ones who I met at CVX Live, if you guys remember, and they were telling me all about this amazing idea they have where they hide treasures all over the world, and I wanted to do one, so I'm doing one with a collaboration with the Jerkies and uh, here's how you do it. So if you guys are not subscribed to the Jerkies, it's a pretty simple concept they have. They take a piece of paper, which is a voucher for a prize, they put it in a bottle. All I had was this wine bottle that I found at the hotel I'm staying at. Uh, so I'm using a wine bottle, of course, here in Greece. I'm gonna take this voucher for a prize that you guys can win if you find this. Basically, I just take it, I'm gonna go over to Mykonos Town, which is over my shoulder here. I'm gonna go hide it over there. And uh, if one of you guys finds it, you are gonna be able to claim this prize in collaboration with me and the Jerkies. So the Jerkies are the ones that are hosting this treasure hunt. I'm just kind of the one bearing it here on their behalf here in Greece. Uh, so I do not actually currently know what the prize is. I do know, however, though, if you do find this prize, you will be able to uh, get a video shout out from me on this video. Like, we'll do a recap video once someone finds it. And uh, you guys will be able to film yourself finding the prize, and it will go in my video. And I'll also put it on Instagram as well. So that's a cool little shout out for you on YouTube and Instagram. And on top of that, whatever the Jerkies 
uh, decide the prizes. I know they always have cool prizes, so you'll win that as well. Kind of forgot that I don't have a <laughs> a bottle opener. I did not take this into consideration. So I have a bottle I can't open. God, that sucks. So now we are just about a couple hundred feet behind those uh, windmills that I was just showing you guys. And the reason I decided to do this little treasure hunt here in Mykonos town is because Mykonos actually has some interesting history. Uh, for a while back in the day, it was actually a sailor's town and they would use, do merchant work here and occasionally pirates would raid this place. So they built Mykonos town as like these very small windy roads where you could easily get lost. And I have been lost in there multiple times already. So they would do that to prevent the pirates from, uh, you know, capturing them and, you know, raiding their their town. So they have all these small, windy roads, and I thought, what better place than in this like pirate raiding town to hide some treasure? I thought it fit pretty well. So we're gonna. Uh, I actually, <laughs> I got the cork open finally. We're gonna take the paper here, and we're gonna we're gonna seal it up. <sighs> Not too tight. So if you guys find it, you should be good. And you'll know that it's my bottle because. It's like some wine bottle that I, I tried to peel the tag off, but like it wouldn't come off, so it looks like a crappy job. That's how you know that it's my bottle. <laughs> so we're gonna hide it now. Um, to actually see the exact location of where this bottle is, you're gonna have to go check out the Jurgies uh, video right now, because I'm gonna be posting the little clip right now where I post exactly where the treasure is. But on my channel, you can see in the general vicinity that I'm behind those windmills, and I'm also at this little church right now. So the bottle is hidden. I hope one of you guys will be able to find it if you want to find the like extra extra little detail on how to find it, go over to the Druggies channel and you can see where exactly I placed it around here. And uh, let me know when you do that. I really hope one of you guys lives in Greece and hopefully maybe someone lives in Mykonos, someone can find this soon. I feel like it might be a couple weeks, maybe a month or two before I actually get a message about this bottle. But uh, I'm really excited to see what happens. So I want to know what you guys think about this whole idea of hiding uh, treasure around. Uh, I might do it myself uh, if I travel some cool places and, and it'll be like just in some vlogs. Like it'll just be a short little snippet inside of a vlog. It won't be like a whole vlog kind of like this was today. But uh, I don't know. I really like the idea that the jerkies have. And uh, I don't know. I'd like to start giving away maybe some of my own prizes possibly in the future. If you guys like this idea, let me know in the comments down below if you think it's a good idea and uh, maybe we'll continue doing it. All right, you guys, that is the vlog for today. I am exhausted. I've been walking around. I haven't been taking taxis. I've been walking back and forth, so my shirts are all like really sweaty. <laughs> but that's it for the vlog today. I hope you guys liked that. Again, if you guys did like the treasure hunt, comment down below if you want me to do these in the future in more countries and states that I travel to. Uh, in future vlogs. I want to give a special notification shout out to you Stefan McLeavy. McAlevy? Thank you Stefan for having my notifications on. If you'd like a shout out just press that little bell button down below and comment notification squad when you are done. Guys I am heading back home tomorrow morning. I get up at 5 a.m. I take a flight from here to Athens and then from Athens to JFK. It's gonna be a very long day. But anyways that is a vlog for today. I will see you guys tomorrow with another vlog here in New York? I don't know. <laughs>